G'day, I'm Tom from Purpose Built Moto. Sitting behind me is an XT250 Scrambler. We took a little departure from the traditional Scrambler styling on this bike, so let me run you through just exactly what we did. <laughs> oh, one take! Where is it? Yeah! <laughs> An important part of building bikes for me is progress. If you're not moving forward with each new project, there's no point. This Yamaha XT250 Scrambler is a culmination of every Scrambler I've built before it, coupled with a totally new style. The XT250 was drastically minimized and lightened. The build started with wheels and tires, 21 inch front, 17 inch rear, relaced, trued and wrapped in Dunlop D606 street legal knobbies. These set the motocross tone for the bike. The rear subframe was removed and rebuilt. The monoshock setup of the XT250 allows a lot of freedom when building the tail, so a light and sharp tube design was used. Next I fabricated a stainless steel header pipe, linking up to a customised FMF power core muffler. The muffler was chopped to suit the XT250 and mounted tucked up under the tail. A set of Renthal handlebars were fitted and finished with PBM push buttons, ProGrip MX grips and shorty levers. The push buttons operate through a Purpose Built Moto black box control module. Up front, a number plate style headlight setup was fabricated and mounted that houses two LED light bars and some Purpose Built Moto indicators. Underneath that is a white Universal Super Motard front fender. These are a little shorter than the normal enduro bike fender. It was chosen to keep things tight and tidy. The suspension on the XT was rebuilt, with the rear lifted 30mm and the front the same. The XT was built for fun off-road, and the extra ground clearance really helps the dirt bike feel of the little 250. Finishing the tail is a handmade motocross style aluminium fender with an integrated LED brake light. The short shaft design is a little different but further pushes the bike into the MX style set, moving it away from a traditional scrambler look. A Makuni flat slide carb and DNA performance filter was fitted and later dyno tuned with our mates at Dynamite Moto. This thing pushes a face melting 13.5 horsepower. The tank was restored to factory colours, with the decals reproduced and the custom tail and front plate painted to match. Although this thing isn't a race spec performer, the humble 13.5 horsepower going to the back wheel is put to great use. The XT250 MXR is super light and really nimble. On or off road, this thing just delivers a good time. That dreamy colour set and the substantial lack of power has earned this thing a nickname the mild milkshake. If you want to see more of our projects, make sure you subscribe and leave us a comment on what you thought of the build.